there is a new place to buy cheap and reliable FIFA coins, go check the link in the description down below and use Crossy for a cool discount and if you wanna buy cheap game codes and prepaid PSN or Xbox cards, G2A is also down below. How's it going guys, my name is Crossy and welcome to another FIFA 17 tutorial. Today fellas, I'm gonna teach you how to cross the ball after the patch. You know boys, every single month EA release a new patch. After each patch, the gameplay changes a bit and after the latest patch, I discovered a new crossing technique, the best one you can use in FIFA 17 at the moment. So make sure to leave a like if you enjoy my tutorial series and if you want me to keep you updated on the latest deadly tips and tricks. First of all, make sure that you use semi crosses. This is the best option if you wanna play the perfect cross in any situation. The second most important thing you need to remember is that from now on follows, we're gonna use the special early cross. You can do it by holding down the L1 LB button of your gamepad and then loading the cross power. With that being said, we can move on to a few deadly variations of the early cross which will bring you thousands of goals. The first one and probably the best one out there is when you get close enough to the end line and you have a teammate at the second post. If you remember, a few months ago I created a special tutorial about this technique. Then he released a patch which fixed the glitch. Now, once again boys, you can glitch the goalkeeper, direct the ball at the second post without any trouble and score second post crosses if you use the special early cross technique. So listen to me carefully, the basic steps you need to follow are pretty simple. Get close enough to the end line, get close to the penalty box, direct the cross to the second post and use around 2 bars of power. The outcome is just amazing, you're gonna send the ball over the goalkeeper towards the second post and then you just need to stick it into the back of the net. Remember, the closer you get to the penalty box and the end line, the better the cross will work. To make things clear, I'm gonna explain to you the difference between the early cross and the normal one. Actually, the early cross is much faster, so goalkeepers don't have time to block the cross and catch the ball. That's why there is another great variation of the early cross, when you catch the opponent on the counter attack. For example, you're running along the wing, your teammates are running towards the penalty box in the middle, so the best way to deliver the ball is by using the early cross. You need to use around 3 bars of power and you need to direct the ball between the running striker and the goalkeeper. From such a position, if you use a normal cross, the goalkeeper will come out and block it, but if you use the special early cross, the goalkeeper will stay on the goal line, so you will get the chance to hit the ball. Also, if your strikers are not running towards the penalty box, make sure to tap the L1 LB button once. It will get them to make runs towards the penalty box and then you can use the early cross without any trouble. Keep in mind that you need to direct the cross between the defender and the goalkeeper so while the ball is flying towards the penalty box, your striker will outrun the defender and hit the ball. So guys, this is gonna be the end of today's FIFA 17 tutorial. Hope you enjoyed the video, if so, drop a like for more. If you have any questions, you're welcome to leave them below. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter for the latest FIFA 17 news and updates. And as always, I will catch you guys later. Bye-bye!